Hello, my name is Jacqueline Garcia Mendoza and my partner is Alexia Pontife Sandoval. In this tutorial, we will discuss the parvovirus index. First, what is a parasitology? The parasitology, in general, is the study of parasites, their host, and the relationship between these. It's the biological discipline and the techniques for fields such as the cell biology, biochemistry, molecular biology, immunology, evolution, and ecology. Return to the what is a parasitis is the is the organisms obtain the food through to the other organisms and produce the means or diet. The next topic is a veterinary parasitology and this is a study of parasites and that cause economic losses in agriculture operations or which infect the pets. For example, uh, Lucilla sericata are lovely, which lays eggs on the skin of farm animals. The mogos hatch a burrow into the flesh, distressing the animal and causing economic loss in the farmer. Other example the of parasites is autodoset cytosis, the cat or mite responsible to the canker, and the Hyrodactylus salaris, a monogenian parasitic of salmon, which can wipe out populations which are not resistant. Parvo or parvovirus index. The parvovirus is a highly contagious viral disease and produce life-threatening illness. The parvovirus attacks rapidly the building cells in a dog's body, severely affecting the intestinal tract. The attacks rapidly at white blood cells and infect the and heart muscle, the heart muscle cause lifelong and cardiac problem. And what are the general symptoms of parvovirus? The overall symptoms of parvovirus are lethargy, Severe, severe vomiting, lose appetit and bloody, full smelling diarrhea, and this can lead to life treating the irritation. And what is a lethargy? Lethargy, lethargy sorry, is an idle state of absolute rest, and that can some animals stay during cer certain periods of time. How is a parvovirus transmitter? Parvovirus is extremely contagious and can be transmitted by any person, animal or object that comes in contact with a infected faces. The virus can live in the environment for months and may survive on inanimate objects such as a food bowls, shoes, clothes, etc. The parvovirus is a highly resistant and Unvaccinated dog to contract of parvovirus in the streets, especially in areas where there are many dogs. And then, how is parvovirus diagnosed? Uh, the veterinarian diagnose, diagnose parvovirus on the basis of clinical signs and laboratory testing. And the test ELISA, the enzyme ligand immunosorbent assay, uh, has become a common test for parvovirus. This detects the parvovirus in dogs' stools and is performed in about 15 minutes because this test is not 100% specific and your veterinary may recommend additional tests and blood work. How can parvovirus be prevented? You can protect your dog from the virus to make sure your pet has all the necessary vaccination. For example, the parvovirus is, should be considered a core vaccination for the puppies and adult dogs. For example, the import, important vaccination is a fighting one. For protects the puppy in, for example, the diseases is the parinfluenza parvovirus, leptospirosis, hepatitis, and distemper. In this picture, you can see the difference 
this is is for the pet and then how can parvovirus be prevent the program vaccination uh, is given at six to eight weeks of age and a booster is given at four week intervals until the puppy will has 16 to 20 weeks of age and then again at one year of age a puppy vaccination program is not complete before four months or age all those who have no receiving full puppy vaccination series may be susceptible to parvovirus and should also receive at least in immunization. Consult with your veterinarian about how often your dog will need to be revaccinated because parvovirus can live in an environment for months. You will want to take extra care if there has been an infected dog in your house or yard. Some things are easier to clean and disinfect than others and even with excellent cleaning parvovirus can be difficult to eradicate. Well, which dogs are prone to parvovirus? The prone to parvovirus in a puppies, adolescent dogs and the canines who are not vaccinated are the most susceptible to the virus. For example, affects to the members of the family dogs. For example, the golvers, coyotes, and the foxes, and etc. For example, the dogs is the Rottweilers, Labrador, Doberman, American in Stanfordshire Terries, and the German Schaefers. And then, how can parvovirus be treated? Um, there are no drugs available that can kill the virus yet. The treatment is generally straightforward and consists of aggressive supportive care to control the symptoms and boost your dog's immune system to help him win a battle against this dangerous disease. Um, your dog needs intensive treatment in a veterinary hospital. For example, uh, the antibiotics, drugs to control the vomiting, intravenous fluids, and other supportive therapies. Show, show your dog undergo this treatment. Be prepared to consider it expensive. The average hospital stay in about five to seven days. Please note that the treatment is not always successful. So it's important to make sure dog is vaccinated. And when is the time to see the vet? And when your pet um, present these symptoms, for example, severe vomiting, loose appetite, depression, and bloody diarrhea, contact your veterinary immediately, please. What are some other health issues with these same symptoms? A puppy with a bloody diarrhea could have a parasitic problem, a block at his digestive tract, or, or have a stress colitis. Well, it is crucial that you see your vet for an accurate diagnosis. Um, well, Thank you for your attention, and um, that's all. Hope you like it. Um, this um, by students of the National Preparatory School, number five. For more information, see reference. See you.